We're on uh, year five of the Mugduk Festival uh, this year. The festival was originally started by a guy called Ern Parkin, and Ern sadly passed away a couple of years back. Uh, 2009, and so really the, the, the festival's keeping his name alive in, in a lot of ways as well. <laughs> the first evening we, we had uh, under a, a singer-songwriter evening, the main act we had for that was James Grant uh, from Love and Money. James has uh, carved out a, a bit of a solo career for himself as well, and we thought it would be a great opportunity to put him in a, into a small song. the book is to the pearl On a stall in the market square I saw his old threadbare mohair A choked youth in my throat The previous years, I don't think there'd any, anyone been as high profile as that. <laughs> Opening up for him was a Scottish, uh, new Scottish singer songwriter, Johnny Jack, so it was good to give him a bit of exposure. You'd have taken me completely, and now life won't. Alone, for you to take me completely as I am. That, that was a great night to, to open up the festival. Uh, the second night we had a, a kind of traditional sort of folk night. We had stalwarts of the folk scene croaking in and that. Lovely, thank you. The opening for them, we had a uh, soul like Bill Adair, and uh, Bill leans towards blues slightly, but he's also been involved in the folk scene uh, here and in Europe for, for many years. Down in old Joe's barroom On the corner by the square They were serving up the drinks as usual Usual crowd was there And then for the final evening which came under the kind of sort of Celtic world music roots night we had a uh, Rachel Hare Trio. Rachel's band's just been nominated for a Scottish Trad Music Award, so it was great to have them there. Oh, Angel, where's your halo? Where are the wings that keep you safe? Did you trade them for a mortal life? Did you trade them for a sin? Or did you trade them for a summer day when winter's tea? Irish piper uh, Brendan McCraner doing the opening spot and uh, Brendan came over from Ireland specially for the show. Even though it's a small 60-seat theatre, the atmosphere you can get in there with the right act is fantastic. The aim now is, is, to, get, is to build the festival up and, and get it firmly on the, on the music festival calendar in Scotland, uh, and I think that there really is a potential to do that. If you're wanting to get out of the city and, and make a bit of a night of it, you know, I, th I think you'll, you'll enjoy the experience if you, if you come out to Mugdut.